Man, I don't know about you guys, but life can be really, really crazy sometimes, man. I just came home. Right now it's 11.53 p.m., almost 12 a.m., and I just got home from work. And I was supposed to be coming home at, like, 9 o'clock, 9.30-ish. Um, and it was just crazy. Something happened, and it it just made, 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 made my opinions on, you know, pretty much things that are meant to be it just, it just makes me totally realize that all of these stuff happens maybe maybe they really do happen for a reason um i mean if you guys haven't already seen my other video uh that i made a few uh, probably like a week back i it's called the sixth sense and i talk about crazy stuff that's happened to me while i was working uh at my new job or basically not not new anymore i've had this job for about two months but um today man the, the uh it just it just comes to show that maybe things really do happen for a reason and <laughs> maybe you know people really do have the sixth sense without knowing it and yes i do know that sixth sense uh is known to uh deal with ghosts and stuff like that but my interpretation of it it's it's kind of like that and at the same time it's to sense uh, stuff that are going to happen before it happens. So that's my take on the sixth sense. And uh, basically what happened today was I was taking a delivery. Well, okay, let me start from the beginning. Before I went to work, um, actually way in the beginning, this morning, okay, to this morning, I uh, woke up and I wasn't feeling very well. Like, I don't know why. I, I was just feeling like um like the, the day is not gonna go well for me i just know something bad's gonna happen and i told my girlfriend as soon as she got in the car when i picked her up to go to school and i was like you know i had i have a feeling today's not gonna go well and she looks at me and she's like man you need to stop thinking like that and so i'm like okay and so the day went on and it's all you know it turned i actually turned out fine for the majority of the day and so i i went to school came home everything was good um, and then it came, uh, you know, it was time to go to work at 5 p.m. So I, I went to work on my way to work. Uh, before I got in my car, actually, to drive to work, I looked at my, my front left tire, actually my front right tire, my bad, uh, and I looked at it and I was like, hmm, it's, it seems a little out of uh, air, you know, maybe I'll gas it up tomorrow um, when I have the time. And I, I, I go on about my day, I'm like, okay um i'm not maybe maybe something's gonna be um something's gonna happen to my car maybe my tire's gonna be flat or something um you know maybe uh maybe i i am sensing something here and so uh i i do all my deliveries no problem okay and on my last two deliveries i i uh before i went on my first okay the way it works at my job to make it more make sense is each time you go on deliveries, you have to take at least two. And so I, I took two uh, of my last deliveries for that day or for today. I, uh, and a, as I drive towards my first delivery, um, I, I, I saw this car coming up behind me and I looked at it and I was like, um, I was like, hmm, that car looks a little odd. And I hear this little flapping noise and i looked at the tire of that car the the front like the or actually the back left uh tire of the car and it was flat and i was like haha you know <laughs> tough luck for that guy um and as, as i make my first delivery i came back into my car um and i i i started driving like 15 feet towards my next delivery and i hear this flapping noise from my car and right right then i knew that i got a flat tire but what happened was um the street that i was delivering to for the first delivery the street was very dark and uh, i don't i don't know about you guys but something about dark houses there the house number just doesn't show up anywhere when you, no matter how much you look at it so what i did was i was slowing down on the uh across from where the houses were I was um, driving very slowly along the sidewalk and I hit a sewer uh, metal uh, I guess sewage thinking of Bob um, you, you, you guys know what I'm talking about right it's the it's the sidewalks where it's flat where cars can go over them but once you hit the sewage it's kind of like sharp 
uh, and indented with like metal and stuff like that and that's what I hit and my tires were ripped and uh, I just felt like I saw it coming uh, because uh, when I saw that first car with a flat tire I just kind of knew I was just like man something's gonna happen something's gonna happen and it did and I just kind of felt like you know I have something to share with you guys because um, who knows maybe the human race or human freaking abilities really they they really do sense um stuff before that happens and um i just kind of want to share with you guys and let me know what you guys think about this i know it's crazy and all but man i just can't believe it happened and it all happened so fast that i just didn't know how to react uh, but i hope you guys enjoy the gameplay it's modern Warfare 2 gameplay on salvage um but yeah i've had fun telling you guys my stories Anyways, uh, I'm gonna go to sleep now. Good night. Stay safe and yeah.